Hey everybody, I'm back with a um, review of a new product. It is the Simple Cleansing Micellaire Water. I think it's called Micellaire. Don't hate me because I butcher names. Um, but it is supposed to cleanse, remove um, all your makeup and hydrate your skin. It is from the company Simple um, and it is for sensitive skin and it says that it has no harsh chemicals, artificial perfumes or dyes that can upset your, um, your skin. And you're just supposed to apply it to a cotton pad, wipe around the face, um, and it's just supposed to remove everything on your face and also kind of cleanse your skin. Also, it's supposed to hydrate it and you don't have to rinse it. So I know micellar waters are really big in the UK. Um, they're kind of coming to the US now. I know some different companies are making them like Garnier, um, Nivea, Simple just made one. Um, we still can't get Bioderma in the US, which I think is crap because I want to try it and I don't want to spend tons of money on shipping from the UK to the US. So I was really excited when some of the US brands started putting them out in the US. Um, and I don't know how they compare to Bioderma. I've never used a micellar water before, so I'm just gonna give it a go. I have makeup on today. I'll do a close-up of my eyes so you can see like the type of eye makeup I have on, but I'm gonna demo it. So I'll close up on my eye and then we'll just kind of get started on the first impressions. So now that you can see what type of eye makeup I have on, I'm just going to kind of give it um, a demo. I have used this before. I know I just said first impressions, but it's more of a review because I did use this yesterday. Um, so I'll show you guys how it works. So it's just a little snap thing. It doesn't have any um, film that you have to pull off, and I just have a cotton pad. So I'm just going to kind of squirt that all on there. And I'm just going to remove one eye. I'm going to do half of my face so you can kind of see what it looks like so I'm just gonna remove this stuff I don't know I don't have any waterproof eye makeup on and I also had a base on today so I don't know how well it's gonna remove it all it actually did pretty good it actually took off I had the um, Maybelline color tattoo on and so it actually takes off that pretty well. I wasn't expecting it to do it that good. And I do have like contour, blush, bronzer, foundation, all that fun joy stuff. Just pop my nose ring out. And as you can see, I mean it's doing a really good job. It's very cool, um, refreshing. It's not like pulling at my skin at all or like irritating my skin I feel like but I feel like it's getting most of the product off kind of in just like a few swipes I know I've gone over a few areas but I don't feel like it's leaving any residue I mean this pad's kind of covered so that's gross um so I'll get another one and kind of go over my eye to see if I can get a little bit more off um I know when I used it the last time it had trouble getting mascara off so I wouldn't suggest like using this straight as like an eye makeup remover you might want to use an actual eye makeup remover and then kind of go in with this yeah see it's still leaving um, mascara it's also leaving eyeliner because I did have eyeliner in my in my waterline so I would suggest going in with like any makeup remover this is one of my favorites it does leave a greasy feel to your um, eye and skin so this would be awesome to go like right in after just remove any excess um, makeup and take that grease off as well um, but I mean it doesn't sting my eyes at all sometimes this is um, very sensitive for eyes but I mean still sometimes it does feel like it's kind of pulling but um, it's definitely getting like everything off I like it for my face like I feel like either I would use this first to get um, the makeup off my face and then kind of um, go in with either like a baby wipe or any makeup um, remover 
like pad or you can just use this and then just wash your face I mean that would probably be easier actually but yeah it definitely got that all off compared to that side so that's cool I don't know how it works on lips so I guess we'll give it a shot it has no smell it's like really refreshing and it feels like legit water which is kind of cool I don't know if micellar waters are split I look really weird like <laughs> I'm so gorgeous <laughs> and this is weird um I don't know if micellar waters are supposed to take off eye makeup so I have no idea on that um, but I thought it did a really good job on my skin my skin doesn't feel dry I do have dry skin um, it's really like cool to the touch it doesn't leave any like residue it's very very soft and smooth so I really like that um, I would definitely suggest washing your face after this just because it's not, I mean, it says it cleanses, so I guess you could, but I feel like it's not a cleanser. So, I mean, I feel like I would have to cleanse after. That's just me, though. Um, but it does have some good stuff like chamomile, so that's going to soothe your skin. Um, it does have pegs, which I heard are bad for your skin. Um, overall, I think it's a really nice product. It's not expensive. It's like... $6.99 I think. Um, I think it does a really good job for face makeup. Um, right now I just use like a baby wipe so I don't have any issues with that. Sometimes it doesn't take off all my makeup so maybe either going um, in with this after or even before um, and then you can just cleanse your skin right away. You can skip that whole baby step wipe or whatever wipe you use. Um, I had no issues with like breakout. I only used it a couple times but I mean my skin doesn't really break out. I have like maybe one right here, but that's just because I didn't remove my makeup at night one time. But overall, I think this is a really nice product. Um, if you're just looking for a really easy step to remove all of your makeup except for your eye makeup, you would probably have to combo. Um, but overall, for face makeup, I really like it. Um, it's really, really nice, actually. I would be curious to like compare it to either Bioderma or some other micellar water, um, especially more of their more reputable ones like Bioderma just because I've heard really really good things about it. I have no idea how it performs besides what I've heard. Um, so I hope they bring that to the US but I don't know if they will. Um, overall I really do like this though and I will definitely continue to use it because it literally is like freaking water. I don't know how that works. Um, because normally a lot of makeup removers are oily, so really enjoyed that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little demo and review. Overall, I think it's a great product. Um, I wish more of the U.S. brands were going to put some micellar waters out, which hopefully they will. Um, but I can't wait to try those out and kind of compare and contrast because this is my first micellar water. Overall, I think it's a really great product if you're looking to cleanse the skin, take all your um, face makeup, makeup off, but just make sure that you do use a eye makeup remover as well because this does not get all that eye makeup off. And keep in mind, I did not use any waterproof um, mascara or any eye products, so if it can't take off regular ones, I don't think it'll take off... Um, waterproof ones either but I hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to thumbs up this video and don't forget to subscribe so you stay tuned for my other videos thanks bye